Internationally renowned for painting in her signature Ndebele style, 81-year-old Esther Mathlangu has no intention of slowing down. She started painting when she was just 10 years old, a tradition passed down through generations of Ndebele women. Her skills have since taken her around the world. When I returned, I went from door to door, encouraging people to send their children to me to learn to paint. A lot of them showed a lot of enthusiasm. They will only come in the afternoon, after school. Now some of them have become really good. Her forebears used only dung and soil to colour their work, which adorned their homes. But Esther was one of the first to start painting these traditional designs in bright acrylic paints and on canvas. When the art that decorated her home was noticed by French art researchers, she was invited to put on a show in France in 1986. When I got there, I was surprised to see a replica of my house there. They had built exactly the same house for me to paint. But it didn't have thatch on the roof, it had an aluminium roof. It even had the courtyard in front. It was exactly the same house. Esther was the first African and the first woman to be invited to participate in a prestigious art car collection in 1991, keeping tradition alive in innovative ways. It feels wonderful. As a people, we must learn to appreciate our traditions. What I don't like, I don't want people to exploit our culture. People must learn from each other. That's what I want. Esther remains a leader in preserving and promoting African art and culture. Most recently, she has adapted sketches made by Nelson Mandela, reimagining them in her own inimitable style.